Praise the name of the Lord. Shalom family once again. Welcome. Welcome to this amazing, great, awesome word. Awesome session. Of course, it's your friend and your sister, Dr. Irene. And I bring you a timely word from the Lord. Hallelujah. God bless all those that are connecting already to this particular session. Do you always stop by whenever we do new video uploads? I bring you this word that the Lord gave me to give you. Hallelujah. God bless you all. Please let's all go ahead, like the video, subscribe. If you're not subscribed to this ministry, and the Lord bless you. Now, God says, I should tell you this. He says, there is no spiritual activity without consistency. Now, <laughs> yesterday, something very funny kind of like happened because um, um, the prayer session God gave us yesterday, God said, dig another well again. So I was kind of like, God was kind of like leading us to say, there are new grounds, there are new things, and there are certain people that need to do it again. And so when I said that word, a lot of people in the live stream, no, not a lot, <laughs> sorry, some people in the live stream kind of like got annoyed with it. They were not happy, you know, so far as it is the truth. You can only get angry, but there is no way you can change it. You must align to it. Hallelujah. God says there is no spiritual activity without consistency. Life in the realm of the spirit is not a hit and run, like you just, you know, just hit and run. No. For you to have spiritual activity, like the angels descending, turning, moving, there must be consistency until your prayer life becomes a consistent prayer life. You will not have spirits coming in during your prayer life or your prayer session to help you. You will not until you are consistent in asking God for the leading, for direction. I'm sorry, honey, you will not be able to hear the voice of God clearly. So you need consistency with your walk with God in order for you to experience the full manifestation of his mercy. A lot of people, they are like, ah, God is not doing anything. He's not doing anything. He needs you to be consistent in that business, to be consistent. You keep doing faith confessions, but you don't, you, you don't get results. Why? Because you're not consistent. Today you'll be positive, tomorrow you're negative, the next day you don't even, you are neutral, and then you expect the Lord to give you results. For your faith confession, for your positive confession to bring fruit, you must be consistent in doing it. Shalom.